welcome back to the channel. Today I want to share something with you which I bought about six months ago. It's just a small pressure washer. Um, it's made by Karcher, which is a pretty well-known brand. Um, I've used it for the past six months. I've used it to wash my dogs, wash my bikes, wash my wheels from my car, hose off my kayak, and I've used it as a shower for myself in the summer as well. So this is it. Um, I've also got a few accessories to go with it, which I will show you. Uh, this is just the accessory box I bought separately um, and I also bought a card charger. It just plug, plugs into the cigarette lighter and then just plugs in to charge it and also you can use it live so you've always got power if you've got a cigarette lighter and you've camper fan or in your car. Um, I've got a brush that also goes on the end. It's good for cleaning your bikes, um, cleaning your muddy boots as well. And this is uh, another nozzle that goes on the end it's just a softer spray and i use this for cleaning my dog's legs after we've been on a muddy walk and this little accessory which i shall show you later um, this instead of using this reservoir here which only holds i think four liters um, you can pull it in a bigger container drop it in use it as a pump so which i use as a shower in the summer which i shall show you again later and obviously this is just the three pin mains charger. Um, takes about an hour to charge and you get 15 minutes runtime. So this is the main unit. All you do is you undo this, fill this up with water and this is your nozzle. Just comes out there, lifts back in and then that just pops back in like so. And then it's the case of just switching it on there and then you've got the actual pressure. These nozzles just twist off so it's really easy to fix on again with different heads. This is the spray one I use for my dogs, it's just a softer spray as I said. Um, and this is the main jet for washing my bikes washing my kayaks off. Um, I'll show you some video of what I've been using it for. So as I said earlier, I do use it as a shower as well. And this is the extension hose I've got. You can put this in a container. I use one of these black con containers here for water. And what I do is I fill it up with water, leave it in the sun all day, and that warms up the water enough for a nice shower of the, of the evening. And all you do is you put this end in the water container. It's just a big of reservoir. And then this bit, if you get the unit, take off this water control housing, and then this just goes inside there. And then switch it on as normal. And then this obviously draws water back into the unit and it gives you the pressure. Um, what I've done here as well is on the handle, I've just used a bit of um, one of these zip ties. So when it's, when the handle is pulled in, I can just slide the zip tie up and that holds it on and then I can use it as a shower. I'm thinking of also finding some kind of suction mount so I could put it on the side of my van so then I can have a proper shower underneath. That's um, something I need to have a look for at the moment. So yeah, this is really good for everything. Well, I hope this video has been of some use to you and um, please like and subscribe and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. <laughs>